what's up guys, Sky from the Crocker Day guys, welcome to another episode of Seminars from Now And we're now currently in chapter 4 And definitely I just gotta tell you guys that this is the second recording episode The second record of this video Cause definitely I have accidentally deleted that part that I've recorded this part So definitely guys If I forget some parts of in here Parts of here Definitely don't mind about it Cause the important thing about this is just about this game So Let's no not about the game about the story. So let's go with chapter four And here we go So by the way, I've deleted three chapters accidentally, but definitely let's just continue this Sorry forget about it. Hey, you are coming to the hospital tomorrow Hospital tomorrow, right? Oh, uh, yeah, that was my plan. I see I've been waiting at where we first met. Okay See you tomorrow Mm. I'm not sick or anything, but could I see the doctor? Oh, you're a dead kid from before. Sorry, but she, he's busy seeing patients now. I'll tell him that you came, so would you mind waiting until the work, working hour is fin are finished? Uh, yeah, sorry, I'll come again. I guess I should have come when he's not busy. Yo, you're late. Thank you, here you go. Huh? A receipt? I had fried rice. Oh, you want... You want to get breakfast? Were you that hungry? The fried rice was great. Huh, okay. What about it? But it was from the convenience store. And it was just a normal one. Let's go... Let's go eat the gravy one together next time. Haruto, don't tell me you went to eat fried rice just to tell me that. Is that weird? Ha ha ha, of course it is. Oh well, next next time let's go together. We did promise after all. Yeah. Hey Riku, I really don't remember much of my of from the past. But bit by bit, I'm starting to recall things and about you. So... Yeah, no, I know. You're, you're you. I'm sorry for saying something weird yesterday, Riku. Hey, by the way, there's something I n need your help with. Let's go. Let's go somewhere else. It was you yesterday about. I was telling you yesterday about what happened seven years ago, right? Yeah, about that, about the accident, right, after, and after that, almost everyone who used to be at this hospital is gone. True, I didn't find any one who was here seven years ago, but what are you implying? Well, I know why after the accident seven years ago, this hospital was designated as the advanced medical institution of the area, but, and by Gardening the best minds in the in the profession, they seem to have end, ended up getting rid of all the old staff. I see, except for the head doctor of Kakarus Floor. That is, he's he'll he's still here. Why do you think that is? Hmm, cause he's specialist in something. That's that's why I thought at first, but around. Around six months ago, we had a new trainee doctor join the hospital. Dr. Shintani was his name. He was a really nice, passionate guy and was really friend friendly with me. He often complained how waking up and uh, up early was tough and had work how hard his training was. But then, about two months later, I just happened to overhead Dr. Shintani comfort the head doctor in a loud voice. He was shouting, Why are you telling me? Why are you letting them die? Please, show them the documents in that room. Where are you hiding them from me? The next day, Dr. Shintani disappeared from the hospital. Hey Haruto, don't you think there's a reason why Kakarus head doctor is in is the only one still here? Yeah, I can't be a 
it can't be a coincidence that Dr. Shintani just disappeared the next day. But shouldn't you try telling this to your parents or other adults? I did. To, to my parents who abandoned Kakeru, my prof, to my professor at Uni and the and to anyone I thought who, who could help, but nobody did anything. Then Tokitsu Group, which runs this hospital, has a lot of influence. Well, it's not the same as complaining at a family restaurant for bad service. Ricky, don't you mean to doubt you about? Maybe Dr. Shintenu wasn't talking about Kakeru when he said letting them die. Nah, it was definitely about Kakeru, although there were some parts I didn't understand. Kakeru and the and the LLMD patients are being left left to die was certainly was certainly what they were implying. I see, and that's not all of it. After that, I was able to track down Dr. Shintani to ask about it. Oh, if that's so, when Dr. Shintani looked at me, he. What he said was, Who are you? Holy freaking crap, guys. There, so, I have known this part since, but definitely, this theory is, there is some, the, the LMD was definitely a curable sickness in this game, and definitely, um, someone had been lying about it since 7 years, and Dr. Shinten have figured out that, but, but the but the hospital kicked him out in there to definitely to not rebuild that thing. So guys, let's just continue this series and figure out what's going to happen next. Which I